Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we are going to learn how to refresh the pivot table automatically. Here we have a data set with year, month, category and amount for Citibank. In category, we have deposits, loans and other services. We are going to create a pivot table for this and set that pivot table to refresh automatically. To do that, go to data, click get data option, click from file option. In that, select from Excel workbook. Now, since my data is in Excel workbook, I am selecting from Excel workbook option. If your data is in some other format, let's say in text or CSV format or JSON format, then you can select the respective options. Click that, select the file in which you have data and hit import select Citibank tab if you have more tabs then you can select multiple tabs as well you can see the preview of the data here then go down and click the drop down next to load option in that click load to option once you click that import data you get import data you again get four options and select the second option which is pivot table report if you want to have the pivot table in the same sheet you can select existing worksheet option if not select new worksheet option I am selecting new worksheet option Option, click OK. Create a simple pivot table. I am pulling category to columns, month to rows and amount to values. Our pivot table is ready now. So what we need to do now is change some of the settings of the pivot table so that it becomes automatically refreshable. How do we do that? Select anywhere in the pivot table. Go to data, go to properties and in properties under refresh control section, you see multiple options. Couple of options are already selected. So we are going to leave it as it is. And now we are going to check this refresh every option. Instead of 60 minutes, we will just give one minute, which means for every one minute, this pivot table gets refreshed automatically. Let's try that now. Hit OK. If you see now, June data is blank, right? So let's go back to our base table and for June month, let's put data as 100. Save the data. Let's go back to our pivot table. Let's see after a minute if pivot table gets refreshed automatically and we get data for June month. Let's wait for a minute. You can now see the data for June month got refreshed automatically. Now let's see the second option that we can choose for automatic refresh of the pivot table. For that, select anywhere in the pivot table again. Go back to data, properties. Let's remove the option that we selected last time. Now let's select refresh data when opening the file option. If you select this option, what happens is Whenever you open a file in which you have pivot tables, the pivot table automatically gets refreshed with opening of the file. Hit OK. We do not have any data for July month, right? So let's cross check by going back to our base table. Let's type in 200 as the number. Let's save the file and close the file. Now the file is open. Let's go back to our pivot table and if you see the numbers are updated for July month. So this is how you can make your pivot table refresh automatically. Hope you like the content of the today's video and enjoyed today's learning. Until my next video, happy learning.